In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the additional tools that are found in the plus circle add content button. There are several third party tools that have been added to the add content menu. Blackboard refers to these third party tools as mashups. The mashups are external websites that share media content such as YouTube, Flickr, Dropbox, and SlideShare. This content can be used in a variety of ways within a course, such as a standalone learning project, part of a test, a topic on a discussion board thread, or as part of an assignment. Let's create a content item. Hover over Build Content, and you'll see that there is mashups called Flickr, SlideShare. So let's click on Flickr Photo. I'm going to search for the words white pelican and I'm going to click go. I can preview. I can also select more options where I can set the license as well as the dates taken. Choosing the first one, I'm going to click select. I can provide a description if I want, and I'm going to choose to show the URL. This will allow students to know where you've grabbed the picture from, and I'm going to click Submit. Notice how the icon is slightly different. This is the mashup tool icon, and you'll notice that you can only add one tool at a time. I'm going to repeat adding a Flickr photo but this time I'm going to use the build content and I'm going to use the item. I'm going to give it a name. I'm going to go over to the plus circle and I'm going to choose Flickr photo. I'm going to use the same search terms, white pelican, and clicking go. I get the same search results. I'm going to click select and again show the URL and I'm going to click submit. And now that I'm done, I'm going to click submit. See that we have the two different types. Here's the one using the mashup tool and this one is using the content editor and the additional tools. A bonus to using an item with the content editor is I can continue to add more information. By clicking the chevron and go edit, I can add more text. Now I'm going to use the plus circle and this time I'm going to add a SlideShare presentation. SlideShare is very similar to PowerPoint, but it doesn't have any of the fancy animations. I'm going to use the same search terms, white pelican. However, we get to choose the language now, so I'm going to choose English and click on Go. You will want to preview to make sure it's something that you want to look at. And once we're sure, we click on select. Again, do the URL and press submit. I now have a Flickr as well as a SlideShare presentation. Let's also use the additional tools by clicking on the plus circle and add a YouTube video. YouTube is unique in that we can put YouTube videos three different ways. This is using the mashup tool, so let's do white pelican again, but this time I'm going to include the term Saskatoon. Let's assume this is the first one that we want, so I'm going to click select, again show the URL, click submit, and I'm done adding information. So I've got a Flickr, some text, SlideShare, and a YouTube. Let's click submit. What is 
cool with these mashups is they show as individual icons. So here we have the view photo for the Flickr. We can watch the presentation or we can watch the YouTube video.